Alright, it's Gold Evil here. Today, I will be playing the first mission, you can say, it's the training level of Hitman Blood Bunny. So, my target today is Joseph Clarence, the guy who caused a lot of kids' deaths on a Ferris wheel accident. So, yeah, any second now, the video should start, and I'll commentate through everything. Good operation. We need you to penetrate an abandoned amusement park, locate the owner, and take him out. Alright, so your boss, the target so to say, is, Joseph Clarence, is telling you the target. An accident and, one of the rides at the park yeah, years back, this is gonna to take a while because apparently you have to wait the for the lady to finish talking the before the guard comes to the gate. Mr. I apologize for the wait, but I really don't want to cut anything out, so, so just be patient. Alright, the guard's ride. coming up now. It's not really that intelligent, by the way he talks. I'm not trying to be racist. <laughs> so yeah, cool way of knocking him out at the gate. Now I'm walking into the gift shop. It says distract the guard, but this is how you really do it. You punch the guy, knock him out, then you take his gun and make sure the guy's dead by shooting him in the face. Even though he's knocked out and he's not really gonna be that much of a threat anymore. You still have to kill him. Now in here, normally I would have shot him right now, but instead I'm gonna fiber wire him to make it look cool. Whatever you want. So yeah, before the guy burns the lawyer, I'm just gonna fiber wire this pretty tough guy. Then, no witnesses, I had to kill the lawyer as well, so yeah. Sorry, lawyer. So I'm climbing up this red material rail stuff, and I'm jumping to the other side of the balcony stuff. Now it's time to get my trusty shotgun and clear this room of the cocaine sniffing guards. Now you cannot continue on until you dispose of the gangsters, so I have no choice but to dispose of them and kill sometime. So that guy's taken care of, and now I gotta take care of this guy. So after this guy's taken care of, you hide in the closet for a millisecond, then you step out and let the guy see you. You need to let him see you or this is not gonna work. So you kill him and take his key card. Don't disguise him, it kills too much time. Now you just take the shotgun and continue on. Use the key card to open the door and clear this entire area of all the guards because you can't have any witnesses. And they'll probably shoot you on sight either way if you bring a gun. Kill this gangster with a shotgun after waiting some time. Then take out your pistol and kill the three remaining guards who are also witnesses that cannot live. So after many shots and the last guy is taken care of, you advance toward the room that's connected to an elevator shaft. I can get the monies. Yeah, forget about him. Just forget about him. So now take down, take out your shotgun, go down there, and kill the guy fixing the elevator. At least trying to. Disable the power to make it look cooler, because you always need a dramatic effect. Then pick up the shotgun and kill the guy who's obviously blind. Now clear the room with the rest of the witnesses, even if they are harmless, they still need to die. Alright, so... Last person is down, advancing toward the bathroom. Time to take out my pistol, drop my shotgun, and take this guy hostage. So I'm gonna do exactly like the game wants me to do and clear the room. Fortunately, I have only one bullet left, and I went for a headshot, but he didn't die, so I had to, you know, beat him up a little bit. Collecting some ammo from these guys and climbing the ladder, which 
which is apparently really hard to find for me. Now it's time to go to the sniper briefcase, unpack it, clear the outside area of the three guards patrolling so I can advance safely without being caught. First guy's on the ferris wheel, I have no idea how he got up there. I don't think he can get back down now. Second guy is on the rooftop, which seems really more easier to get up to. And the third guy, he's really hard to find for me. Please pardon my mess ups, but I finally found him on the ground level. So now it's time to go outside where no guards are patrolling. Collect some ammo from the sky so I have two mags left instead of just one. Now it's time to enter Mr. Clarence's office and kill his niece and his guard that's inside the office. So kill him before you even show him the photo because who cares? The client's special request has been denied. Let's go. Time to go outside, advancing toward the next building. Running along the walkway. Now it's time to climb into the window. Um, I didn't even pick up the bombs because I'm in such a hurry, so don't forget about that. Forget about that. Clear the room of everyone. No witnesses, no survivors, everyone dies on this mission. Now, after the last guy is dead, you exit very dramatically after making sure that girl's dead. So I hope you enjoyed this video that I made. It's the first one, so please don't like judge me if you think it's bad. I try my best. So I'll see you guys later.